Health experts, regulatory agencies, and stakeholders are here to provide solutions to the challenges facing healthcare equipment business in Nigeria. This is because patient safety is priority in healthcare delivery. That's according to Dr. Ifan Yingwankuo, National President of Healthcare Equipment and Allied Product Providers Association of Nigeria. Henceforth, this association, as a matter of fact, in order to save the industry and our businesses, we compile lists of all the chief medical directors in this country that do not pay us and then officially submit it to the Ministry of Health and the federal government just to alert them that these people are killing our businesses. Mustafa Falaki, Chairman, Board of Trustees, HEPAN, urges regulators to be transparent with the quality of medical equipment and payment of duties. Anwanyang Kechuku, Regional Vice President, North, says once there are errors acquiring equipment, patients will be affected. It is not just enough to bring in and distribute medical equipment. We must also ensure that these tools are of the best quality, affordable and accessible to every Nigerian who needs them. The medical equipment and the consumable providers are very integral members of the healthcare value chain. The medical director of Federal Medical Center, Abuja, highlights the importance of ensuring quality facilities in the diagnosis and treatment of diseases in healthcare. The clinical diagnosis and treatment is central to effective healthcare delivery. Because when a patient comes, he has a problem, you must establish what that problem is. That's the first thing, regular maintenance. You don't have to wait until the equipment has uh, stopped working or start developing problems. There has to be schedule for regular maintenance of this equipment. Other experts in the healthcare value chain prefer solutions to the challenges in the procurement of health facilities. We now have a special corridor. If you have challenges with the importation of your products or your, what you bring in from legitimate and genuine sources, we have a special corridor organized by the Healthcare Federation of Nigeria with the customs authorities to ease all the challenges with, health, with uh, importation. The Federal Ministry of Health should clearly define the boundaries of NAVDAC and SON to avoid the conflicts and double payments that is borne by the importers and transfer to the patients. Participants agree that prioritizing safety of patients is crucial when dealing with equipment procurement. Uli J. Wapera, Arise News.